everybody, it's Alana, and this is... Oh, me? Yes! Oh, I'm dead. I'm Alana's dad. You do this every time! <laughs> Today we're here to give you guys a little review, a uh, campsite review. Went to a campground a couple weeks ago, and we had a really good time. We're just going to tell you guys a little bit about it. Uh, the campsite was called... Caboose Lake! Caboose Lake in Remington, Indiana. It's off I-65. Uh, some of you guys probably heard of it, maybe you guys haven't heard of it, but we're going to talk a little bit about it. Because we did went to a couple campsites this summer, we're going to start doing a bunch of reviews for you guys. I wanted to say where it was. Huh. Oh, where was it at? Did I say it already? Yeah! Where was it? Okay, you can tell them again. It was located at Remington, Indiana. Oh, Remington, Indiana. Yes, we live in Indiana, and it's, it's great. We love it. All right, so we got one on the weekend, right? One Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Oh, what she's done. All right. <laughs> so. All right, so we went on the weekend, went Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Okay, so we got there. It took us, uh, what do you think, about an hour and a half, two hours to get there? Two hours. Yeah, had a Taco Bell next door. Amazing. We love Taco Bell, but he's going vegetarian. <laughs> All right, so we pulled into the campsite. We first got in there. It's right off the highway. You can actually see it from the highway. Uh, some people say that it's too close to the highway, but that's not true. I think we have plenty of space. We did a lot of stuff inside the campground itself. So we pull in the registration first because of the whole COVID thing. We couldn't get out of our cars, right? So the guys came out with masks on, and they took our name and number down and information. And the staff came back out to us and gave us the, our, our site where we're going to be at with the tag. It goes in the window. So they were really nice. They were really friendly. Yes. 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 So then we go a little farther into your left-hand side. You see, what would you see, Lily? Caboose. So I saw, I saw, um, like little spinny thingies. It's called merry-go-rounds, guys. Back in my day, we called them merry-go-rounds. There was like a little playground. Mm, most of the things, or not most of the things. Some of the things were closed, but in the morning, they were they were actually like. Yeah, we got there a little a little later. But yeah, they had like the teeter totter thing. They had a little swing, playgrounds, right? They had a water tank, right? They, they had a dunk. water balloon, like, was it like a water balloon toss? Yeah. Kind of a thing? That's kind of cool, right? They had a whole beach area. And inside the beach, what do they have? They had like a pillow, like a, um, a thing, and you like, and that one of them was the end, and then he'd go to the end, and then somebody off, uh, somebody else would jump so on. It's like a big trampoline in the water. Right? Out. Oh, your watch hurt me. <laughs> so it's like a big trampoline in the water. Like, what did you do? You sit on the pillow and the people that jumped on the trampoline jumped on the pillow and we do what? And they fly you off. Right. And then they also had a tower, a climbing tower that you can jump off into the water. Got a big old water, what do you call those? Like the uh, water... Like a water... Water mat. No. Water mat you can run yeah, on. Yeah, they didn't have a water mat. Then a big old water platform if you swam off a little bit. But you go to school, you can rent kayaks, what, fishing boats, paddle boats. It was a cool lake. We were set up. They were pulled around site, so we got a full hookup site. Uh, because we pull all, they tell us to pull all the way around. You pull right through your campsite, you get out, hook up the sewer, you, know, you hook up your your, uh, your electrical, and your water. Yes. So it was all it was all cool. We had a good time. I had a real good time actually. Uh, it was busy, kind of busy. There's people from, where they, Texas, down there? A lot of people from Texas there. We were all playing bags. If you guys ever played bags, people call it cornhole. We were playing a big old game with them. Uh, we messed with a couple neighbors. They came over and hung out. Our friends came down, they hung out with us. So yeah, bonfire. They have, every, every site has its own little bonfire bonfire pit. And we actually ordered wood and they came and dropped it off to us. Yeah. I just, dude, I did, my dream is to have a golf cart. And they had golf carts there. And so I, me and my friends, we all went up and we're like, oh, we're going to get a golf cart. We're so excited. We're finally going to get a golf cart. We walk up there. They told us that there were no more golf carts. We've been to a couple sites this year and they've all been out. All of them. All of them. All of them. All of them say they're not ready till the middle of August, September. They're all sold out. But the campsite was fairly large. That's you know, why we're buying one. They even had a sand volleyball court. We didn't play volleyball, but some people were playing volleyball. But we did go fishing. And we went fishing. Yes, we, did. we caught a little bluegill. They're little guys. Just a bit too so it rained one time for a little bit. It was like heavy. Like really 
heavy shore. No, we don't mind. We hung out in the rain. After it rains, it's the best time to go fishing, I think. Not really a fisherman, but the, right here. The thing about like the pond, or the, the beach thing, was that it was so shallow that you couldn't really catch anything. And if you wanted to catch something, you had to go like all the way far, far out. Well, the beach is pretty shallow because you can walk in there when you go out to the beach. Rocks and rocks and rocks. But after a while, you have to actually swim. Yeah. So the whole thing wasn't shallow. I mean, it does get pretty deep as you go. What do you think it was like? Because you can go on the trampoline. That's, that's not that deep, right? And the little climbing wall. Actually, we got a map if you guys can see it. I'll upload it too. And they do like different things. Um, I think we had beach night that day. Was it? They had a beach, beach family night that night, Saturday night. You can pause to read. That's all right. I'll upload it. Or watch. They had a bunch of staff there. They were helping the kids out when they were doing different events, like the what the 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 dunk tank, the dunk tank one, and then the what was the water balloon one that they were doing? Did you do that one? I also had a big like a uh, what do you do? You you uh, jump shot water wars. Had a concession stand. But we didn't go in the concession stand, did we? Did you guys go in the concession stand? Or it was closed? It was closed. Okay. They have a laundry room, which is great. But all in all, it was a good time. We had a good time. It was a good time. And they guess they even had Wi-Fi. Which that was... Wait, did they have Wi-Fi? They did have Wi-Fi. I remember they have Wi-Fi. What's telling the address? The address is 3657W West, W or West, US 24 Remington, Indiana. Elan, let me ask you a question then. Would you go back? Yeah, I'd go back. Yeah, it was a fun time. Staff was really friendly. They were nice. Of them. Yeah, I didn't get yelled at the last day we were leaving. We did? Well, I didn't get yelled at. She just kind of said. She was mad at me because my front tire of my truck was parked in the grass. Hey, if they take care of the grass, take care of the grass. And guess what? You guys are going to experience a full... Uh, the next campground we go to, we're going to get a golf cart. And you guys are going to see me driving around. And we're going to go everywhere. Right, Dad? Everywhere. Everywhere in the campsite. In the campsite. Everywhere. All right. So out of a five stars, what would you give it, Alana? Four. Four. Okay. I give it a four. I give it a four too. It was nice. I had a good time. Hey, guess what else do they have? In case you don't have a tent or a camper, you can rent a caboose and you can stay in there for the weekend. So we're going to a place next time. It's called Twin Mills. And I guess they got like a, like a cornhole tournament, golf cart challenge. Uh, they got a beach there, uh, movie theater, baseball fields. We're gonna check that one out next. If you guys <laughs> want us to come review your campsite, let us know. We'll come there. Almost well, not too far of a drive. Yes. But I mean. I recommend you build one in Arizona so that way we could just go over all the way to Arizona and check out your goal. We, we will go anywhere. Yeah, we're going to start doing a bunch of reviews as well. So if you guys like the channel, go ahead and like, subscribe, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and guess what? You should hit the notification bell because then you can get notified every single time we post a video. Mm -hmm. And it goes like this, it goes ding. <laughs> All right, till next time. We're in the camper, so we're out of here. All in all, we did have a really good time. I'd give it like a, like I said, four out of five stars. I would recommend the place. I'm definitely gonna go back. Like I said, we were fishing. We were in the beach. Uh, the kids had a great time. All the neighbors and I. The staff is really good. All in all, it was it was a really really good time, right, Lana? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, what's that behind you? What?